She's out of her mind, but she's in this theatre. Say hello to US legend Ruby Wax. Hi. Hi, thank you for, I'm thrilled to be here in Melbourne. Um, I was here about 13 years ago and then nothing. Nobody called, nothing. Uh, thanks for having me back before I've gone completely incontinent. So thank you. Big thank you. A, a few years back, uh, I became the poster girl for mental illness. I did. Thank you. Uh, thank you. And um, one person clapped. That's good. Do you guys know Comic Relief? Do you have that here? Okay. Well, they, you know, some of the money goes to mental health or mental illness, so they asked me if they could take my photo. So, you know, my career was, you know, going toilet bound, so I said, sure. I thought they were going to do like a teeny picture. I thought it was going to be stamp size. But when I went into the underground, do you guys know what an underground, do you know? You'll have one someday, but anyway. <laughs> I went into the underground and there was this gigantic poster of me, huge, saying, this woman has mental illness, please help her. <laughs> So I was mortified, and, um, and so I hurled myself, you know, in front of the poster so nobody would see it, and then I thought, that's okay. I went down the escalator, and there was another one, so I hurled again, and I kept going down, and I just kept hurling, and then I thought, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to write a show and make that look like my publicity poster. <laughs> Thank you. And, uh, you know, I thought, Rube, you've got a disability, use it. So. Uh, <laughs> You know, it's funny, I'm not embarrassed about it, because you can't talk about this stuff usually, because it used to be you couldn't say you were gay, and then a while back you couldn't say the C word, cancer, and then a long time back you couldn't even say you were a witch. <laughs> but uh, now it's like, it, it's really popular. I think people with, you know, things wrong in the upstairs area, it's one in four. It's more than the flu, really. So if it was like one, two, three, four, it's you, man. You over there. You're not right. And, and your girlfriend's not good either. That's not, she's melted over there. Actually, that whole row isn't good. Not good at all. And you know, it's one in four in the UK, which really surprised me because I went to England to get away from crazy people. No, I went because I thought, you know, people would be charming and delightful. People love, people like Mary Poppins. And Winston Churchill, there we go. People are having a whole country having a cup of tea going, would you like a cup of tea? Oh, I don't know, would you like a cup of tea? That might be lovely. Would you like it with a Bicky? Oh, I don't know, Bicky. Or maybe a Kit Kat. Oh, that would be lovely. And everybody else talking about the weather, whole place, going, would you like, do you think it's chilly? Oh, no, I don't think it's chilly, I think it's breezy. Oh, I thought chilly, do you think chilly? Oh, I think windy, blowy, blowy, windy, windy, chilly, chilly. Oh, no, Dad's dead. <laughs> Oh, let's have a lovely cup of tea. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Um, I'm done now, so you can play the music. Thank you. <laughs>